Howdy right, folks, it's the Tall Turtle here. Welcome back to Forza Motorsports 7, the Forza Drivers Cup, where we're racing every single race on the way to the Cup, just because we can. And um, those of you who are watching, thank you very much, because like I said in the previous video, I've been looking at my stats, not that I really care, but just out of curiosity one day, and I noticed that most of these videos, the racing ones, have no views at all, which is totally fine. So those of you watching, thank you very much. I know people are here mainly for Flight Simulator. And um, I will be doing more flight simulator as my schedule gets settled in again. More changes to that, which I'm not going to get into this time. Anyway, those of you who are here, thank you for joining me. And let's race some more racing. All right, next one on the list is the classic muscle. Let's see what he has to say about this. Mr. Narrator, you have the talking stick. When you strip them down to the chrome, muscle cars are rather simple despite their sound and fury. Take a big engine, keep adding power until you wake the neighborhood when you rev it up. They are loud without apology, and we love them for it. All right, and we're going to do the 69 Pontiac GTO Judge. My dad had a GTO. What year is it? 65? 65, I think. But let's race this one. All right, for this one, we're going to turn off ABS. Turn off traction control. Turn off stability. Did I say on? Off for everything. Manny with a stick for this one. And friction assist off. Okay, here we go. Prague, my favorite. I just love how this city looks. All right, standing start as opposed to rolling start. Clutch in first gear. Oh my gosh, it's just been months and months and months since I've shifted in this game. Let's see what happens here. Oh, I love this. Whoop. I don't have a tachometer. Where's my tachometer? It's in the front. Okay. On the hood. So they took off the overlay because it's just more fun to have to look at the gauges in the car. Um, I guess we need to turn. Oh, there we go. Okay. Man, I've not driven cars like this in so long. This is so much fun. Um, for this video, I'm going to stick with the highlight format. Just to see how it goes. Then maybe we'll jump back in at another time to every moment of every race. But I'm going to race around Prague. And um, disturb people with all the noise. And I'll see you at any highlights, if there are any. Alright, we're in third place. After some drifting around those corners, not sure what happened there, but here we are. It's interesting because even though the average difficulty is still in place, I feel like things got a lot more difficult during the month and a half or two months I took off. Holy cow, it's hard to get back into this. But I'm not going to make it easier because I want the challenge, and the challenge is what I'm getting, and there's our first place finally. That's, um, oh yeah, careful with that downshift. Where's the road? No, seriously, where's the road? How can I not see the road? Well, the first place was fun while it lasted. Um, let's see if we can get back up there. Oh, and by the way, all these assists are off. Yeah, I, I think I showed that to you. No assists in this one, so we're running raw. And that could be a little bit more of the challenge, but um, yeah, I don't know if the Masters, if the Masters Cup or the Masters Championship just suddenly increased the difficulty or what, but. I'm finding this, okay, let's not lose a roll this time. I'm finding this to be much more difficult, like suddenly. Anyway, we got through there in first place. Hopefully we can hold this now, because this is a lot of fun. This is a lot more my style um, than those indie cars from the previous episode. I'm also shifting less too. I just don't need to shift so much. All right, here we go. Let's get through this and get our win. And we did it. Yay! Coming in first place, they're not even in my sights. Long Beach. Okay, I think this will be fun in this car anyway. Okie dokie, everybody. Well, let's get into first gear. Oh, I love those wheels, the Pontiac wheels. Even our trailer, camping trailer, had wheels like that. My dad put the Pontiac wheels on a camping trailer. It was really funny. All right. Nice burnout. I keep hitting the rev limiter because I can't really see that tack on the hood, but that's okay. We are not in a comfortable position on the track for this turn. Let's just work our way inside here. And get in the second. And not get spun out. And, oh, I love it. Ooh, who's pushing me? That whole time I was getting pushed sideways. And here we go. Let's get an early... Whoops. I didn't mean to use him as a bumper. Let's get into an early lead here. 
I hope we stay there. And here we take P1. Downshift in the second, except I killed engine because I locked the tires. Well, that's okay. And then we have this crazy churn that's in every single circuit, no matter what. Get into first gear and just take it tightly. And let's enjoy your lead, not hit our microphone. And if we can make this corner up here, we should be good to go for the rest of the race. Two laps down with a nice, long, comfortable lead. Cornering is going well, braking is going well. I finally feel like I can enjoy what I'm doing. I mean, don't get me wrong, I really enjoy the Indy cars, but I'm enjoying this even more. There's one nice corner. Actually, that wasn't very good, was it? It was good last time, I promise. And then we'll pump the rev limiter. And then we'll take this corner, like this, and increase our lead. And let's do that one more time. Should we do the final lap together? Why not? Let's do the final lap together. Let's come around this corner. There we go. We even got a good turn credit for that. Well, it's not really credit, it's just a thing on your screen. Let's see, I have the mod up. We get another good turn. Another one? Nope. Hit the gas a little hard on that one. That's okay, but look at our nice comfortable lead. Awesome. Another corner coming up here. Then we go down to second. Now, there we go, rev match. Well, a little excitable on that one. Let's see if we can keep our lead. Oh yeah, there we go. No problem. Too busy talking. That's okay. And we're going to come down into first gear for a nice tight corner. Did not set that up well again because I was talking, but that's okay. We're going to win this race. Keep us in first for the series so far after two. And let's move on to the third race. Homestead in the rain. This will be fun. Ooh, here we go. Let's have a second gear start. So remember, we're running raw. No assists or anything. Plus, friction assist is off. So that means we are very likely to spin out here because it's going to be so slippery that any little thing we do could kick that back in around. Because we're raw without friction. Raw and friction assist is off. Oh my goodness, just trying to get through traffic here. I'm not trying to use them as my guardrail, but it's difficult. All right, here we go. Come on, out of my way. Oh, trying to get around him. See, it's raining, so it's really slippery. Doesn't it seem to affect anybody else, though, which is what I don't kind of, can't quite figure out. It does not seem to affect the AI, just me, but that's okay. We'll make the best of it and enjoy it. Just have to be really careful. And I'll show you any highlights when there are some. Bad to let out for first place here on the long straightaway, but man, that was a slippery corner. Shouldn't be able to do it. You just have to be very careful. But we can't quite go wide open because of this corner slippery. I'm just concentrating. Yeah, I'm trying to turn. I can't even turn. Because of the friction assists, I can't even turn. This is hilarious. There we go. We need to get our lead now. Because we're going to need it to get through all this other stuff and stay ahead. Where is the turn? Here somewhere, right? Yep, there it is. Oh, don't lose it. No, no, stay, stay, stay. There we go. Too many pedals. Come on. You can do this. Let's see if we can stay ahead here. Somehow we're maintaining our lead. No idea how, but we'll enjoy it while we can. Um, got one more crazy corner here. And then we can just go for it. Gotta be careful because there's that puddle. See, any hydroplane on puddles. So be very careful. There we go. And away we go. And we're going to recover from this one. Um, we did. I don't know how. That was crazy. But very fun. But very crazy. Now let's concentrate. And try to win this one. Man, my steering wheel is shaking all over the place. This is really difficult. 
Alright, it's stop raining now. We have one more crazy turn. And then, um... We should be scot-free here. I know I'm coming in really slow, but I have the lead, so I really don't care. I just don't want to spin on that. And, oh yeah, way less slippery now that it stopped raining. I was way less slippery. Definitely a difference when you have friction assist off. But it does make it a lot more enjoyable. You gotta be careful on this turn because um, you can't go wide open in this car. I just can't handle it. Yep, see, I'm losing it. Oh, oh, come on. I was so close. Yay, three out of three. First place. Big lead on this one again, too. Willow Autodromo Internazionale. Club circuit. Okay. I don't remember this one. Standing start. And, um... I seriously don't remember this one at all. But here we go. Let's see how this goes. And... Burnout contest. Not very long, was it? The first one was the best. Um... Let's see. I'm trying to... Don't, don't go through there. You get spun out. Oh! Oh! We made it. Here we go, buddy. Come on. Come on. Jeez. Hmm. Again, not trying to zoom as a guardrail. I'm just trying to get away from the cars behind me. Just trying to play their game. Jeez. Um, so far, so good. I guess. Ready? Oh, I missed the shift, but that's okay. I got past the guy behind me. Come on. Whoa. There we go. Finally got a clean corner. Oh yeah, it's this track. Of course it's this track. I remember. Which way does it go? It goes this way. Oh boy, out of my way. See, my exit needed... Oh, wrong road. This road. <laughs> Well, that was a fun lap. Now if I can just get past these two guys here. Or drivers, I should say. And then, um, get another win. And there's our P1. Snuck in on the inside. We did ram them a little bit, but that's just how this game works. Once I'm done with this Driver's Cup, one of the things I'm going to do when I race is every race I do will be full simulation damage and all that stuff if it is fun but if I did that during this driver's cup we just we'd never get anywhere so that's one thing I'm looking forward to doing but right now we got this race to finish um what what happened there was that a rev match or what I don't understand I just lost control like oh my gosh seriously Oh my goodness. No. This is not cool. Dude. Well, let's see if I can get back up to the top. That was really weird. I just lost control. It must have been a rev match thing. I'm not sure what happened. But I started spinning out. And I wasn't able to recover because they got in the way. Or I got in their way. Whatever. Here you go. Let's see if we get back up to the front. Um, well, oh my gosh, we're not going to get back to the front of that, it keeps happening, this is a bummer, I was hoping to win all of these, oh well, we'll see, maybe I can back up there, I doubt it, but I'm going to try, I'm definitely going to try, I'm in the top 10, um, here's the corner where I lost it, I don't know why, because that was fine, and then this should be fine, Right? Yeah. So I don't know what happened there, but it really screwed things up, didn't it? Alrighty. Well, top ten finish. We'll enjoy it. Hope he doesn't hurt us too much. It drops us only down a third. Two races to get that back up. Y'all, yeah, Sabrina. This should be okay. Alright. Night race. And, um... 
I'm gonna concentrate a little bit here, see what happens. It's hard to concentrate, my microphone just got my way, that's okay. Let's stay on the inside here. Although we can't set up that quickly, it's just so we don't get spun out. That's all. Come on, guys. Alright, things seem to be okay so far. Just taking it easy here. Until I get through traffic. I want to be careful about these sharp corners. Because we don't want to get spun out. Oh, where'd he come from? Oh well. Okay. We got this one. We gotta be really careful here. Let's get on the inside. There you go. Stay on the track. Our first chance to overtake a few if we get our shifts done well. And are we gonna overtake them before the corner? We are. Here's our P1. Going all the way down into first gear for this one. And there we go. Where does the road go? I don't know. It goes that way. And an early P1 spot on the first lap. And two more to go. We'll see what happens. All right, two laps down. Still in first place, but our lead isn't that great, so we gotta be extra careful. I'll race, race like you're in second. Um, just so that you concentrate and push, 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 because if something happens, you don't want them catching up. And we're pushing a little too hard there, but that's okay. And pushing a little too hard. We got a few cones. And we're gonna enjoy first place win. I was going to see easy first place win, but it wasn't that easy. And we move back up to first. Nope, second. We got to work hard for this last one. Hopefully it's enough. All right, Lime Rock, if I pay attention, this should be pretty easy. We'll see, though. Standing start. First gear. Clutch in. On that gas pedal. And here we go. Burnout. How long is burnout going to be? No. Nope. My first one was still the best burnout. Um, really? I know these cars are old, but are the drivers old? Let's get going, everybody. That's not hard. This is an easy track. This is one of the easier ones. Come on. It's just this gets tighter. Yep. We know this track very well, don't we? Second place, almost right away. Hopefully we can get first pretty soon here. There we go. First place right away. I did not use him as a guardrail. He used me as a guardrail. Easy first place lead, as long as I can hold it. We should be good to go for the rest of this race. Easy first lap with a strong lead. Still want to be careful, though. Um, come on. Yeah, from there. You gotta be careful when you start talking, because then things happen just like that. We had a strong lead. Hopefully we can maintain the strong lead here. We do have the weird double chicane set up, which I wasn't expecting, which I'll show you in a moment. Um, because I don't know what other highlights are going to happen, other than the finish, hopefully. So let's just show you the chicane up here. I was not prepared for it. We'll go all the way down into first gear. There you go. One direction and two, but if you know it's there, it's a piece of cake. Okie dokie, let's finish this thing. Alrighty, let's finish this together here. Easy peasy Sunday drive. Just go to whip around this corner. There we go. And then be kind of careful around this corner, but take it pretty much full speed. There we go. Whoa, maybe not. There's 90 miles an hour, 100 miles an hour, and another easy win. But is it enough to get us in first? No. But well, we made monthly progress in the of Thon, I guess. Shoot, finishing in second, but that is enough to get the championship. So let's see what Mr. Narrator has to say. Outstanding. The Master Championship is yours. You're on the verge of racing glory. 
dig in and bring everything you have. You're now racing for the Forza Drivers Cup itself. Alrighty, we're still gonna race every race because we can and we have, you know, the time to do it. It's not like we have a deadline or anything. So let's go back to the main screen. All right, another check mark and another one there. Ooh, and I get a car that I'll never drive. And an outfit I'll never wear. Sounds scary. Not sure if I'm ready for it. Anyway, we got nine more to do in the Masters before we move up to the Forza because we want to. Alrighty, I'll see you then.